Version. Da, das, das, hat dir, das, hat, das hat dir gefallen, wie Natascha den Namen gesagt hat. Immer noch im Gespräch, natürlich mit Consuelo Costin. Wir könnten noch Stunden weiter quatschen. As, as we said before, you're coming back next week and the week after. Definitely. I, I'm Every week it's now Consuelo Costin on the show. Since you I'm don't like have a, a return really ticket to, to the States. Really never goes away. <laughs> But we have to talk about the yes. brand new album. Here it is. I'm just me. What's the album about? I, I believe that you don't really have a motto or a theme for it. What's it about the album? You know, this the album I'm Just Me is is really every song tells its own story. Mm -hmm. It's it's kind of my own chapter from my life. Um, it was really important to me because I I believe that we're really not in an albums market anymore. Mm -hmm. It's such a singles market that every song. You know, it took the time, whether it be six months, whether it be two months, yeah. it was to really make sure that it was exactly the way that I wanted it to be. Mm -hmm. And being able to travel and work with writers in Nashville and L.A. and London, um, just incredible collaborations. I, I bet. I mean, so, it, it was recorded, in, as, as you said, in different cities. Yeah. I think even in, in, in Montreal and in, in Oslo, even though... You weren't really there in the most place. I think you were in, in Nashville, you were in Los Angeles, I think in, in Tampa, Florida. In Tampa, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. but you must have met along the way many interesting uh, people. Just incredible producers, amazing writers, and brilliant musicians. John Blackwell, who mm -hmm. is Prince's drummer, played on my track. Yeah. He played a girl with a loaded gun and run, and he was absolutely awesome. Uh, Anthony Little, Greg Freya, just really talented and brilliant musicians. Um, working in Nashville, I have to tell you, is a fascinating experience. I bet it, because it's all about music in Nashville, isn't it? Well, and just the writing structure and mm -hmm. really learning how to write. And you have this three-hour format, and you basically need to write the melody, write the lyrics, and have the full song done, um, and they expect that. And if you don't have that, that's, there's an issue. And so you're doing that for, like, three sessions a day, yeah. which I find so interesting. Whereas in England, like, you're sitting there, you know, you have your glass of wine, and you're drinking, you know, Completely all night. Different and, yeah, world, it's right? totally different world. So, so you, did you write everything your, yourself, but also doing uh, lots of collaborations on this I did. album? About 95% of the songs, there's only two or three that I didn't write. Um, yeah, it's really important to me as an artist to mm -hmm. be a writer. I always said I wouldn't be a singer if I didn't write. And the first song is Lose My Mind. As I said before, the video was shot in New York at Vanderbilt Museum. I believe the scenery is set in the 1950s, but tell us a bit more about, about the song. What, what's it about? So, Lose My Mind is a song about that unrequited love. Mm -hmm. So it's that feeling where you're in, you're having this experience and you really feel that someone else is having the same thing and they don't. Okay. <laughs> Which I, I, uh -huh. I had one of those sad experiences. Okay. Now, have you had that? I think oh, most of us had yeah. that experience, right? Okay, thank you. You're not making me feel like I'm alone here. Okay. <laughs> no, you're not. You're not alone. <laughs> okay, at all. good. Um, and we shot this. Actually, this is my great grandmother's summer house. Yeah. And the Vanderbilt Museum is everything. Every room is still intact. Wow. As it exactly was. So m a lot of my family members, actually, up until my mother's generation, were arranged marriages. Mm -hmm. So it was a really interesting story to actually be able to tell that. Um, about the choice that I make. Mm -hmm. And you have to watch the video to decide which way I go. And we'll do that right now. Wir gucken uns nämlich jetzt den brandaktuellen Song an von Consuelo namens Lose My Mind. Ist übrigens ähm, im Vanderbilt Museum in New York äh, gedreht worden. Und es geht um äh, arrangierte Heiraten. Das Ganze spielt in den äh, 50er Jahren. Und da gucken wir jetzt mal rein. Hier ist das aktuelle Album. Es ist überall erhältlich. Und hier ist Lose My Mind für euch. Seconds that hold you back from me, left, right, 
Da ist das aktuelle Album von Consuelo Costa. Gerade die erste Single gehört Lose My Mind. Thank you so much and all the best for this album. And anyway, uh, we're going to see you anyway again next week. Next week, you next know week, I'm coming back. Nächste Woche ist er wieder hier. Da reden wir noch über, über the jury. We have to we talk, talk about, about the so many I things. I know. But up to this point, all the best for the new album. Thank and hopefully you. we're going to see you then on, on tour here, maybe in Nordrhein-Westfalen in, in, in the near future. Can I, honestly, it's been such a pleasure to be here. It's a pleasure for honestly, being on, on so our show. Much. Thank you so thank much. You Consuelo Vanderbilt Kostin, heute bei Live, der Kurs natürlich nochmal alles in Ruhe nachlesen auf unserer Homepage nrw.tv. Da gibt es alle Informationen, da kommt ihr auf ihre Homepage, auf die Facebook-Seite, die Twitter-Seite, es ist alles verlinkt und auch alle Infos zum Album. Vielen, vielen Dank. Thank you so much. Thank und, you äh, so geht's much. Gleich weiter. Geht's weiter mit dem Sport? jetzt? Oder haben wir Musik? Musik? Wir haben Musik. Ja. Okay. Musik. Hast du schon, schon Angst gehabt? Hast du schon Angst gehabt?